Hello. All right, all right, all right. Um, am I looking a little bit rough? Can you tell it's a little bit cold? It is late October in good... Um, in I was going to say good old Canada, but in beautiful, fairly new Canada. Yeah. So... Um, I'm recording this on day 69, like 69 days left until the end of the year. Um, I'll probably still post it with 70, but it actually wasn't making much sense for when I was saying, you know, 70 days left, and then I wouldn't really be able to, to, to talk about the 70th day because it was still in progress. So I'm doing it a day later than usual, but I think this makes a bit more sense because I can talk about day 79 to 70 instead of talking about day 79 to you know the morning of day 79 also this this spot here is kind of annoying i don't like looking at that anyway um you know it's not that it's not too cold it's just a little cold um so i'm i'm actually feeling a bit ill right now um i was hoping to get a bit more active because i've been lazy for the last few weeks or so uh, i think i talked about that last check-in this is annoying me sorry i should stop looking at it but I'm, I've been feeling a little bit ill last few days, and then I had something last night, and that made it a bit worse. So my throat is taking the brunt of it, so I probably sound more ill than I feel, but I still feel kind of ill right now. So let's get to it. Uh, day 80, we talked about last time. Uh, I bought some dates, though. Some uh, dates I've been waiting an entire year to go back on sale. Okay, so October 13th, day 79, um, I watched one episode of Bleach, I did some work, um, and I played Wales, Wales Geoguest, so, so my home country of Wales, my sister, I, I spent ages on um, Google Earth, so, or Google Street View, sorry, um, collecting images of places that I, I knew my sister might know, and then I, I made her guess where in Wales it was and then she a couple days later she returned that favor to me so that was really fun uh day 78 I played the long dark I got attacked by a bear twice <laughs> almost the third time it was really close um I had some struggles with a bad my bad a bad habit I have again uh, which was a little frustrating you know crush that uh Thanksgiving dinner with um <clears throat> my new stepfather, cool, first proper Canadian Thanksgiving. Um, a lot of Canadians don't know what Thanksgiving is about, so it's kind of hard to figure out what it's about because people don't seem to know. But yeah, I'm, I'm getting there. Uh, fun family time. Uh, and then my sister returned the Wales GeoGuessr. Or I think I did more Wales GeoGuessr. Um, some nice music. Did not watch any bleach. Uh, day seventy seven. This was a good day. This was a really good day. So I hung out with my friend. Oh, well, first I made some stew in the morning. It was a really busy day. Made some stew in the morning, which I'm actually cooking right now. It's on the stove, so I shouldn't speak too long. Um, I played with my friend some disc golf. It was really fun. We played in uh, Cumberland. It was really nice. Uh, found a lot of mushrooms, a lot of really weird, really weird mushrooms. But the only mushroom I actually managed to find and identify was some Slippy Jacks, which I, I dehydrated, but I didn't get much out of them, unfortunately. Um, I, I was, I'm looking for a good rain jacket, because although I'm just kind of taking what I already have for my camping adventures and stuff, I think getting a quality rain jacket slash windbreaker would be great. Still annoying me. Um... Yeah, and then I, I hung up with another one of my friends, one of my new friends that, that I made recently. And, uh, yeah, that was pretty nice. Uh, we did an art night, but we also did a lot of uh, games, some board games and stuff. That was really fun. <clears throat> I went for a walk in the forest, found some amber jelly fungus. Really cool stuff. Uh, and I saw some military flares being fired up um, above the sea, uh, the Salish Sea. It was... Really cool. We called the non-emergency hotline, and they're like, "Yeah, it's military activity. We can confirm that." And we've been told to uh, uh, not respond to it by the military. So you're all good. We've been getting a lot of calls about that. So that was really cool. And I did about ten hours of socializing. Wow. And I didn't watch any bleach. Wow. <laughs> um, and then day seventy-six, um, 
reminds me of Fallout 76. So oh dear, let's go, let's go. Only 2.5 months left. Um, and I think I was I watched some Bleach and I was inspired by it because it was talking about, oh, we only have two and a half months left. We're doing visor training. Uh, there's a showdown in the winter. And I resonate with that because I'm like, that's how I feel. There's a showdown in the winter where I have to become nomadic and start camping and stuff. <clears throat> Yeah, God is good. I played some Half-Life 2, and I watched 11 episodes of Bleach. So I did some really good catch-up that day. Day 75, I went to um, the bank, had a meeting there, trying to sort out my financial stuff. Um, watched some more Bleach, watched five episodes, and I, uh, I borrowed my, my friend's raincoat to try it out because he has a similar one I was interested in. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> then... Um, Day 74, I went to the doctor, and man, I've been really paranoid and really worried that I've, I've had uh, I had cancer or something like that. I was getting, like, growths underneath my skin, which have been growing for the last few years, and um, I'm always worried that I have parasites or something like that. Partially anxiety, partially, you know, just eat, eating a lot of berries and a lot of foraging and stuff like that. Just worried that I, or water, worried that I'm not. Uh, purifying stuff properly but i think i'm overly concerned about that and i got some really nice comforting news that it, um i do have some um that the issues i was having was just because of some deficiencies some really simple ones b12 and iron which uh, i thought i was kind of covering but i realized you know when you're not having regular intake and you're relying on like a couple sources you really need to be paying attention, especially with iron. You need a bit more than you, you think you need. And because I was getting like half my iron intake for months or however long weeks, uh, yeah, I just want to remedy that. So I'm going to be trying to correct that in my diet. Um, I was recommending supplements, but I said, hey, I want to try and correct that in my diet. So, you know, white kidney beans, chickpeas, dark chocolate, um, fortified cereals for iron, B12. Uh, that can be, uh, I forgot the other source, but, um, uh, fortif was it fortified, uh, yeast? Um, you can put that on popcorn and stuff, uh, but mostly where I get it from is Marmite, and that's a really good source. Yeah, so that was really comforting. Um, yeah, and I was really excited about that, and I watched 10 episodes of Bleach that day, and did some good work at, at, at the restaurant. Yeah, so day 73, I watched seven episodes of Bleach, um, some work. We watched uh, Hocus Pocus, um, and that was my final day. Oh, no, that was my second final day of work because in day 72, it's my final day of work, and I had a lot of very mixed emotions about this. I was excited. I was nervous. I was happy. I was feeling really sad the night before. And I was glad that things are getting better and I have the opportunity to have some free time to try and tie things up. And it really made the fact that um, I'm having this lifestyle change very real. Yeah, it was it was difficult because I really like my coworkers, but I just don't really fit in very well with my line of work, unfortunately. Um, it was such a, a strange, difficult day, but I, I, you know, I tried to reach out with God and, and, you know, have him comfort me and, you know, just trusting in him. Yeah. <clears throat> and I went to the pub for the first time and had kombucha for the first time, which was really something I, I'd been kind of a little freaked out about before, but it was, it was nice. We talked about bears. I went with my family. It was my sister's one year anniversary where she's working and it was my celebratory Hey, I'm, my employment status status has changed. So that was really cool. Uh, and again, struggling with my bad habit. And it's weird because I feel like a lot of time happens in between. I, I go to that bad habit. But um, no, not so much. <laughs> Feels like a long time. But no, I, I do it kind of often. I've mentioned it twice in 10 days now. That's pretty bad. Um but I was trying to be kind and forgiving on myself, but I need to, to do better and I need to go to Jesus and get his help, not rely on my own strength. Yeah. Watched three episodes of Bleach. 
um, I said, much love. God is with me. Uh, it will work out. Oh, and when I finished work, I ripped off my shirt and put it in the bin. It, it split really easy. It was really ragged. Yeah. Um, so unemployment was achieved. Uh, 72 days left. Um, 71 days, I slept in. Uh, I did a Bleach live stream, which was cool, on my YouTube channel. I watched six episodes of Bleach. I played some Half-Life 2, struggling a little bit, and playing Follow Freeman. Uh, yeah, it kind of felt a bit unfair, but it was some cool set pieces. And then day 70, I watched three episodes of Bleach. I did another Bleach versus live stream. I have two of them now. You can check them out under my live category on my channel. And I spent time with my sister. I played Age of Empires uh, 2, Definitive Edition, with uh, my friend and his friend. Uh, uh, I played a little bit on the door frame. Me and my family were like climbing up door frame Olympics. And I had a coconut. I split it up. I had the water. It was delicious. And I had some of the inside. But you know what? I think even though you can get very ill by eating gone off coconut this coconut was not gone off but i've been feeling a bit ill and maybe there was some bacteria in the coconut water um and it, i woke up with it really really in distress throat when i get ill my throat is the first thing to go it swells up really bad <clears throat> swells up really bad um yeah so i'm just gonna i'm just trying to eat I'm trying to take it easy i should spend more time outside because i spend so much time inside i want to get more active again and actually, the, last night, I kind of cried um, around 3 a.m. And just all of a sudden, it wasn't like nothing really instigated it. Just all of a sudden, I was like, man, I need to get serious about this. I need to get serious about this. I didn't have like a moment where I was reminded of something. I just all of a sudden was like, ah, oh, I just need to get serious. I need to be active. I need to hold on to God. And yeah, I just had a big moment last night. Uh, woke up today, had a brilliant time playing the long dark with my friend but that is day 69 and uh, so i will talk about that when i do my 60 days left so that was day 79 to day 70 ending with the coconut that's made me a little bit ill so uh, you, you can get seriously ill but it's not it's not a bad coconut i think it just had a bit of bacteria in the, in the water the rest of it really does look fine so uh yeah and it feels mild so i'm just going to keep eating and, and get whatever came in to come out and just take care of myself, get some more fresh air and stuff. So yeah, I'm going to end the update there because we're already at 13 minutes and I have something cooking, but uh, I'm struggling a little bit to get a good pace with bleach. Um, and tomorrow will be my first day that I would have been at work if I was still employed. So I'm going to try and pretend like I'm still at work and try and do, you know, six to six to nine hours, six to eight hours, something like that, uh, at least of doing project work. And then I can do some cleaning and organizing too. So thank you for tuning in again. Check out my Bleach live streams that I've done recently if you're interested in that. If not, I put out a, a Shrek Dill Pickle review, which I know has a lot more widespread appeal. Uh, Dill Shrek Pickles, that's all very, very interesting stuff for most people. So. Yeah, check that out. I filmed it a while ago, so I, I have my beard still when I was still the stallion. But thank you so much for watching. Thank you for caring about my um, video di diary, my blog entries, vlog entries, whatever. I have 69 days left until I'm leaving um, for an entire year. And I'm starting to have to th plan and think about that, at least the first portion of my my uh, month long camping in rural North Vancouver Island in the dead of winter. So I need to be thinking about that and if I need to get any more gear um, and stuff like that. And just taking care, making sure I have enough iron and B12 and, and yeah. Okay, I've talked enough. Thank you. God loves you.